Steve, tell me about your visit to the site of the Large Hadron Collider. Well, it was very interesting. To begin with, we were surrounded by some of the brightest scientists in the world, thousands and thousands of them, who were all working in and around a, a hole or a tunnel, an underground tunnel, that goes around for 16 miles, 300 feet under the ground on the borders between France and uh, Switzerland. And inside is what a lot of people have called the world's biggest machine. Uh, more steel than, than it took to build the Eiffel Tower. Um, and uh, cables, magnets, all sorts of stuff. Just a, a melange of electronic equipment. And what exactly are scientists hoping to achieve with the collider? What they're trying to do is they're trying to take some of the smallest particles in the, u in the universe, protons, and smash them together at the, at the speed of light to essentially find out what's inside or what happens when you smash them together. And what they're looking for are among the smallest particles of the universe, things that have never been detected uh, before, that they think uh, will help them figure out why different particles come together to form certain things. The Collider recently experienced an equipment malfunction. What does that mean for the operation? It's going to be about a two-month delay if everything goes according to plan, a minimum of two months. Uh, but it's not serious. They've been conducting uh, a test for several weeks before this happened. Uh, but it's a very complicated machine and things go wrong.